Okay, so as I was saying, I got cut off there with the record. So I think I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a, maybe a half part upload alongside this one. Uh, because, yeah, I kind of lost track of time, but that's alright, because I wanted to do a couple extra turns anyway. So this will be, uh, yeah, this will be a half parter. So anyway, as I was saying, I want to form a second force here with these officers and then send them towards Shangyong and then we'll have these guys here to either back them up or just, they can set up an operation here and just, uh, Mm, so basically set up a pick so that they can't get through or they have to worry about that and that should isolate Shang Yong I think we'll do that because I, I, I don't really know when Zhang Lu's gonna march out and even if he does he's gotta cross these mountains it might take him too long so this is gonna be a hell of a fight over here Ling Tong is there. Ling Tong is there. Wait a minute. So he joined Sun Quan? He was working for Salta. I guess he came over. Came over to Sun Quan's force. That's definitely him with his inflated ass uh, assault stat. His ridiculous assault stat. Okay, well, I guess we have to deal with him too. Okay, what to do with this 13k? Probably just send him to the front. Start. Let's wait for that to, for those guys to arrive and then, and we also have to assign some ranks. Oof, have to, some tough choices there also. Not only ranks too, but also uh, some tactics. I need to teach my officers some new stuff because I have some really good uh, officers, solid officers, and uh, they just don't have, some of them just don't have very good tactics. Hopefully Zhou Kang can get away up there. He was a bandit, so he should be fine, right? He was a turban. Okay, so we'll see. I need my goose guys to pull back. There we go. Perfect. And hopefully Cheng Dao and uh, Yong Kai can bear the brunt of uh, Sun Kuyan's march. So Yu's not taking any damage at all. Okay, so Ling Tong's gonna swing around our flank. He's most definitely gonna do that. And Zhou Yu's not taking any damage at all. So we're gonna have to move him up. That sucks because it's gonna open up our flank here, but I don't think we have a choice. We're gonna have to. Slide everybody over. Actually, let's slide Wu Yi over and see if he can repair the tower. Keep it up even a little bit longer. So, we're gonna focus, we're gonna try to crash down the right side of his vanguard. And Ling Tong is gonna crash the left side of our vanguard. So, we'll see which one gives way first. I'm assuming ours because, again, this guy's assault stat is ridiculous because of his not just the cores but his annihilator it further increases your assault I wish we had one more unit we could deploy and uh, that's basically the catapult if we, didn't, if we didn't send out the catapult okay so he's giving chase most definitely but he should be able to get away, right? I mean, 
At least on paper. Let's see if we can restrain him again. Uh, I don't see it there. Decrease morale. Let's do that. Release check so you gotta be crazy. You'd have to be crazy. I wish there was more use for uh, intellect officers in this game though. At least on the field. I kind of miss that. I miss being able to put more than one officer in every unit. And um, because your officers would influence different aspects of the of the overall statistics. Um, but this is fine too. It's not. It's not a. It's not a big gripe with me, but I just liked it because it give it gave you intelligence officers us. something to do. In the older games, you could put them with uh, with their own tactics and add them into the formation also. So each officer would bring a tactic to the table. And you could put up to five officers in a formation. I think in Romance, that was that's in Romance Nine. In Romance Eleven, I think it was a maximum of three. But still, your and your highest intelligence officer, he would contribute towards ploys and stuff like that. But uh, maybe it didn't translate too well. You know, maybe they, when they were building the system, they were like, you know, the best way to do it is going to be just one person commands the unit. I don't know. I don't know if it would unbalance the game if you could put two or three, or with the way they have it set up, if it just wouldn't matter enough. Okay, we've got three prisoners. Jiang Wan has appeared, but he's working for South South, of course, go figure. As if this guy doesn't need more people I mean I guess I don't need more people either but come on salsa come on okay so before I deploy anybody how many people do we have on the move we have quite a few okay so we'll wait a little bit before we deploy anybody though else I'm gonna have to rework the ranks a little bit I could do just do like a Overall promotion, auto promote, but I like to get in there and get a little specific with my promotion, so. I really hope these guys can hold, though. everybody going where's everybody going what is happening captured by Eugene so Oh, he must have gotten held up there. Well, that sucks. Well, let's see if we can get a... Uh... See if we can get him back. We set all this up and they're just gonna withdraw. That's pretty strange. Hmm. Oh. 
Well, I guess we'll push up towards the city, see if they, uh... I don't know, see if they do anything. We feed the place from the city at least. Or well, might not, but... Because he's marching towards there, he felt the need to withdraw everybody. Oh, something weird happened here because I thought the snake should the snake should have been faster. Maybe because he's still on the water though, right? He just got on land. Yeah, that, that's probably what it is. <sighs> okay. So, wow, let's see what we can start moving people up. Oh, we gotta leave a spot open for Juan Tzu. So we can put Hikui there. Kong, Siege. <laughs> and then from here, honestly, I don't know anybody else. Maybe Zhao Yi, because we could give her the boost in leadership. Her leadership's atrocious, it's like 44. Okay, 45. Oh, that's not much of a boost at all. Okay, we don't even have a lot of depth, honestly. As you can see, there's no real standouts uh, beyond, like, maybe the first three, four guys. Okay, and then we can appoint a few ministers here. On there. Okay. Hopefully, we can get back uh, Zhou Kang. Started off well, but I mean, we lost. We lost Meng Da. And then Zhou Kang got captured, so. We really just took a beating on that one. And, uh, didn't really. I mean, we did use. We did. We did deal some damage to his units, but. You know, his. He's already replacing his losses pretty quickly. I definitely can't go after Runan because this city's ready to go. So we're definitely going to play play on the left side here. Tang's trying something. I don't know what he's trying, but I wish him the best of luck. Yeah, because if we can take Shang, Shang, uh, Shang Yong, then we can maybe put Hanzong in a pincer between the gate and Hang, uh, Sheng Yang. So let's see who we have here. I need to move these guys. They're just clogging up my list there. All five of them.
では向かうとしよう OK so let me see we can give these two guys a rank increase I don't know so much about him Can definitely give the other guy one though. So at least up to eight. Let's see, seventy-four. Send them up for sure. So let's go twenty. Send him seventeen. Mighty. Okay, and so let's summon uh, Zhang Ren over here. At least Zhang Rang and then another maybe uh Quan Kong. Okay, those two can lead the attack. Over there. Okay, we should have guys here ready to develop these lands back up. Searching Wu again, okay. Dosta Yatero. Ever do it. Okay. And then, oh, he's not done building it yet. Should be this turn. Okay, so Sun Quan's force is withdrawing. I guess because she is yeah, attacking their city, so. <laughs> They're coming back. Oh no, I've been duped. I've been duped. Oh no, we're out of formation. The old switcheroo, eh? Suckered me out. Look at this. He sacrificed his king, though. Most definitely. Oh, 
Wow. What a tangled web. And weave. Okay, so Huang's on to tie it up. He's not going to be able to break off. Well, he's going to be in trouble. I'm going to need him to slide over. Slide over all the way over. Get out. Just need Huang Zong to try to slide over too. Oof. Okay. We need to bring Yong Kai over here. We need to get Lian Chi out of here, really. Maybe another hex over, and we need to get our catapult towards the shore at least. Okay, so let's get Yan Yan over here because he might be able to trigger something. Maybe it was because I changed the orders to cross over into his territory? I don't know. I don't know, but that was like some, uh... That was some smart stuff right there. Oh, man, so I've ended up attracting everybody. Damn it. <sighs> I didn't want to. I did not want to fight everybody. Okay, maneuvers up to 31. So Liu Kui might act, should actually outpace the fish. You should beat him in the race over there. Maybe these guys can like take this core, take that core. You know, just kind of run, run around, be annoying. Yundaka. Oh man, I can't believe he pulled that on me. I can't believe that. Man. Okay, these guys are ready to go. We don't even need to wait. We can just start heading start heading out, so. Send these for I wish Wu Ban was healed, but he's been He's been hurting for a good little while now. So we're gonna we're gonna let him stay back. Okay, so we've got two melee units, two range units, okay. Tactics. Looks good to me. We have enough supplies for this journey. We do. Okay, so we're gonna head towards the port. And he's already heading up, right? Okay, so we're gonna send. How many units do we send to back him up? Back our forward units. Can't be too slow. And there's no reason to ever not deploy Semayi when you can. <laughs> yeah, I think we just we sent Semayi. Maybe not Wu Lan because he's reckless. So that would be Huang Zhu. That leaves either Huang Zhu or Li Yan. Could even send our ruler, but he doesn't have a formation that's fast enough to really to head out there and kind of head back. Li Tong's also reckless, and he can't command too many units. I could regret it, but we're gonna send him on. Could end up regretting it though. enemy assault, ignite, I don't like that one. Let's go with Jir. Really all he needs is inscrutable schemes. Let's give him calm. Okay. So we'll send these guys out to Ji Yang. They might draw up more units, which is fine. Although I can't imagine from where right now, just looking at the map at a glance, but if Sao Tao can find a way, he will. So, 
you can find a way to deploy more against us, he most definitely will. Is he the only one who can transport right now? He's not. Okay. So, send another 10. Oh, you really need to send gold, I don't think, but let's send a 10 up there. So we'll wait for Yahoo uh, Yuan to head back all the way back and when once he's done and he's actually all the way over there then we'll go ahead and uh, head back out. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to have Huang Zong use his tactic right away. So as soon as the as soon as it turns over here and it starts Song. And we, I could have Yan Yan use his ivory bow, but it just seems like a waste here. So we're gonna save it for Ling Tong, maybe. Okay, there goes Sun Koyan. Zoyu captured Zoyu. Okay, we need to make sure we have supplies here. So Okay, so let's see if these guys will switch places again. Let's get Huang Zong to crash down over here. Because he did take the core, so... Can't just let him get away with that. Cheng Dao's over here. We can have him maybe build something because we have more. He's got more people on the way. So, you know, I know I have her out here, but I'm just going to tell her to come on back, send them over here. So we're going to need the soldiers. Okay, so he's already sending a ramp to break everything. Let's get a uh, he Kui out there. Just he Kui, I don't. I don't know if I want to send Zhao Yi. So even despite the the fight that we had at the beginning of the video, we're still, you know, he still got, he was still able to replace his losses very quickly, easily. Still feels like he's just getting stronger and stronger. So 
probably doesn't it doesn't feel like I did much by attracting his attention and staying and fighting but I'm sure it did you know because he would have been that more that much more uh, farther along if I hadn't tried to at least put up a fight there hopefully he's not completely blocking me. Be a little awkward there Okay, so should be able to should be able to take him out fairly easily this turn. It's just gonna be a matter of how much damage is he gonna cause. Alright, so she's gonna do this last turn and then we'll wrap up this part. So I wasn't expecting it to be quite so long, but Okay, so once he engages, we'll use Ivory Moon Bow to increase our defense because Lin Tong's assault is crazy. Actually, I'm not sure if I could... Could I hit him with this and just restrain him? Hold him down? We could do that also. Let's do that. Let's just hold him down there. Doesn't look like it applied restraint. Okay. Okay, looks like he's trying to withdraw here, but we will try. We'll definitely try to catch him. I wonder why the restraint didn't work. Maybe he has a trait. Let's see. Oh, he's got five traits. Most likely one of them helps him towards that. You cannot be inflicted by the status element restraint. There you go. Yeah, otherwise they would have held him in place and I think we would have had him right there. Okay, so he's got a few more guys. Really good officers, but they're coming in separated and disjointed, so we should be okay. And Sun Kuyan's going to have to worry about his city. Sheik's here is going to be able to march pretty easily now, so. Alright guys, well, I'm going to wrap up the video here. Um, next one will be the live stream saturday at noon central timing and uh we'll see if we can we'll definitely take hui ji i mean we should be able to take it um if we don't take hui ji it's gonna be because we're too busy draining all his troops but we should be able to at least take hui ji and have sun kwayan surrounded on the brink and we're gonna keep pushing north towards south south more importantly these two cities should be fairly difficult and then the really difficult cities are going to be here because this is where he has his power these are his power bases so uh hopefully maten can hold on that's all he's got to do is hold on as long as he can but jeff uh if you like the content, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. And uh, see you guys on the live stream on Saturday.